Hey y'all, welcome back. Episode 5. Alright, so we had gotten to Montemerte, we had stocked the our water pump and our defenses. We need to find some more dudes for these other places here. Let's see. I don't want to lose syndicate points, so let's see. So next we're headed to Mountain Way and getting some art. So let's reset the flag. Let's head out. All right. You've arrived in Mountain Way, a small town located in a narrow gorge leading from the central plains to the western mountain. The gorge is also the only way to reach Metropole. Got the task done? From the glassy eyes and uncommitted parents, this old man doesn't look at all there. He stares off the distance, ignoring you. After a minute, he suddenly turns to you. And a voice very low whispers, says, You guys, couriers. Yeah, you need something delivered? Something like that. Uh, where are my manners? I'm a teacher. At least I used to be over an iron bucket. You might have heard of it. it fell to infected horde ten years ago. The big one that came from out west. The horde came. I took shelter in the school storehouse. My students. We had food and supplies to last a few years at least. But after a few weeks, the horde showed no signs of abating. Eventually, the infected must have sensed there were still people in the storehouse. We'd hear them try to break through the door. All of us are huddled together, crying, prayer for the end. After all, we were unarmed. Most of our number were children. So I volunteered to draw the infected away. It was a suicidal task. What choice did we have? Slipping out a window, I ran as hard as I could, weaving through the horde of infected. Some of the infected followed me, but not enough. When the infected closed again, I had no choice but to run away. I surely would have died had not a group of soldiers rescued me. I told them about the students still trapped in the storehouse, but they told me I was insane if they thought they were going to go back in that mess. Sad story. What happened next? It's been a decade since then. The infected horde is long gone, but I've never grabbed the courage to go back for them. Could you could you go there and see if anybody survived? Tell it's safe to come now. For this teacher is very, very sorry. I'll give you 3,000 scrap for your time. No guarantees will find anybody, but sure. Here's an advance. If you find any survivors, tell them I sent you and they'll pay you the rest. Okay. So, overdue apology. Alright, so we got the musician, but we're not stressed. Higher fitness, the less fatigue you get from driving. There's less of a good in stock. Okay, supply and demand. You hungry? No. Uh, tasks. Overdue apology. That's an iron bucket. That's the other way. Ah, they do sell fuel. Okay. Uh, scarce items. They're the ones we want to bring water to. So you guys, 52 of my waters. Okay. And then what do they sell that's funded? They sell rawhide, charcoal, squab. They sell all the... Hold up. Did I... They need squab and scallops and shrimps and all this other good stuff here. So let me go back to the store. Okay. So they wanted some squabs, some pheasants. Uh, let's also buy another 400 fuel. Okay. All right. Let me see what. So I need a steel pipe. Blah 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 blah. So if I make a bat, no, because I've got a shotgun now. So the next, the next upgrade is I need to make a pipe gun. So I need foil, a steel pipe, and pig iron. All right. And for the steel pipe, I need a metal club, a bat, and pig iron. Okay. So let's make a bat and a metal club. And then I will go see if I can find some pig iron. And then that will... And then we'll get a bunch of pig iron and foil. Okay. And then if I do that, I can craft the musket and the pipe gun. And then I need a musket and pipe gun. And then I can make her a standard pistol. Okay, doakleys. I'm going to run through the store real, or the bar real quick. And we'll see... Oh, okay. First off, let's just go over and buy junk. Uh, foil? Pig iron? No? No? Uh... I'm going to buy some fiber. Okay. Uh, foil pig iron. Mystery liquid. Buy scrap paper. And then I'm going to go down through here, per the usual, and see what they have for junk. Nothing I want. Okay, we got our parts for crafting stuff. Let's see what these deliveries look like. Northern Lookout. I mean, we're kind of going that way anyway. Yeah, we'll get that. And then we'll grab the bounty. Where's your go? Swampy Glades Rest Stop. Where the heck is that at? Oh, no. That is too far out of the way. All right. Okay, it's raining like hell. Yes, bounty location. Head to the, all right. Reset our flag, and we'll actually head out to there. All right, engine too cold installed. Step outside for a smoke. Okay, abandoned bridge again. Try to navigate through. Oh, we dinged up the truck. Repair the hull. Okay, and set out again. All right, got there. You you arrive at the location bounty. Small cabin. They sit, they make a run for it. Shoot him in the leg. <laughs> Requires dead ammo. Really pursue them. Really pursue them. They say they'll be given a show trial hang if you bring him back to the city. Offer you 1,800 scrap for their freedom. Uh, not a chance. Okay, so we got to transport him. Where are we transporting him to? Montemerte. Okay, that's my city, but okay. 
Uh, yeah, we'll do that, and then we will like come out this way to go to gas station 66. All right, reset our flags. Yeah, we're good uh, unless they have tires for sale, which they do not. I will have her buy all their salt pork so we can make. Oh, wait a minute, no, it's just pork with pork that we need. All right, um, I'm a little tired, but I think I can make the make our our town. Okay, all right, we've arrived back in Monte Muerte. Got 50 clout, 1200 scrap. Got a deputy to lock him up. All right, let's go to the apartment, sleep. I'm gonna check the box. We only got the one dude. Can I do anything to raise? No, because I don't have any building materials. Um, okay, let's head out. Clunker Town probably has tires. Clunker Town does have tires. Let's go straight to Clunker. Well, so we're going to set our flags. Let's go straight to Clunker Town. Uh, so we'll go there, and then we'll check out whatever this is, and whatever the that is over there. All right, head now. Found a crash plane. Search it. Scattered suitcase. Got some useful supplies. All right, keep on, keep it on. All right, we're in Clunker Town. Let me... The trailer workshop enter we needed okay the travel trailer adds one to the crew limit uh, i really want the goods trailer but i will take the travel trailer i mean it'll drop our load down yeah oh okay gotta go sell some creds then oh really okay actually let's go to the store let's see what their abundant items are let's buy so hold up we're going to going to gas station 66. That's high command. Yeah, they want fish, crab, squab, pheasant, venison. Okay, so any of those. Uh, they don't want any mushrooms. They want wood, canned fruit. Okay, so let's see. Because I really kind of want to go across this line. Get it. Whatever this is, whatever that is, whatever this question mark is, and then go ahead and get over here. So, but I also want that trailer. Man, let's call the bank and just get ripped off. Okay, let's sell creds. Let's sell a hundred and... 50 creds. Let's sell 200 creds. Now we have enough to get the uh, crew trailer, and then we'll install the crew trailer. Alright, and then uh, we will... Oh, 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 oh. Do we buy tires? We need to buy tires. So, a bunch of items, buy tires. Give me, like, 10 of them. Give me, like, 20 canned fruit. Oh, because that's all I have left over. Okay, let's buy, like, 10 can Buy... We already got the squabs and everything. All right, let us head out. All right, because we make a door. Who we got lucky on the tires. We had seven of them we needed to replace. All right, let's reset our flags and head out. All right, engine was too cold and has stalled. We're gonna step out and have a smoke. Set out again. Uh oh, we've got the road ahead is covered by a sickly looking fog. It seems to be slowly drifting towards you. Charge through, speed through, or flee, or haul ass out of there. Uh, okay, so this requires three hours. This requires 20 fuel and three hours. We're going to flee, go. Hey, you drive the truck around, peel out of there. There's a toxic fog phase out of view. Your crew means a sigh of relief, not to mention fresh air. Lost fuel 20. Let's see where we're at, though. Okay, we are almost to our... Yeah, let's just keep on. Find a lone robot walking through the wilderness. His movements are jerky and uneven like a newborn giraffe. He's equipped with a sword of light and heavy weapons, but all of them seem rusted. Come back later because I know... I... I know from playing previously what that is, and we don't want to do that right now. Okay, reset our flag, head for the supply cache. Okay, so we can, since we stopped here in the forest, because we were looking at the moon, we can forage for food, buy some mushrooms, we can hunt, search for, ask the small animals, okay. <laughs> Apparently we can talk to the, the animal handler's Dr. Doolittle. You can ask a bunch of small animals, you big animals. One bedding artful rabbit points you in the right direction. Okay, hold on. Head to the test. Okay, so we... Uh, reset. Let's go here. Uh, Dr. Doolittle can drive. Okay, so the way this works is you want to get your hunt up to a better percentage, and you want to make sure that their alertness doesn't beat your distance, so let's... Ooh. Okay, so they've got alertness up. Let's hide. Hide. Let's observe. Let's approach. Let's approach. Ah! But we got it is just decreased, and we raise our hunting. Uh, we are almost there, so let's go ahead and head out. Oh, you jerk. Okay, let's go for that supply cache. Mandy, take us out. Looks like the syndicate used this place as storage depot. You can't figure out why it's been abandoned. Got four liquor. Great. Okay, let's look at the map. Um, Mandy, take us to this abandoned amusement park. Let's reset our flags. Mandy, take us to the abandoned amusement park. All right. We ding the truck hole again, getting through one of the narrow gaps. Fix that. Check the tires. Doot, doot, doot. Get rid of that one. Engine's fine. Mandy's fine. Let's go. Okay, we're tired. It's raining like hell. 
Uh, let's collect rainwater. Uh, we're still tired, though. Let's, uh, camp. Let's, let's try this again. Can't hook up if you're fatigued. Okay, so let's sleep, and then let's try to hook up again. Fell terrible prowess in bed. <laughs> 9, 91, 96, 96, 91. Okay. Um, let's go over the kitchen. Let's start a fire. Let's make some water. Uh, we're both still tired, so let's sleep in. 15% chance of getting attacked. We are gonna boogity boogity out of here. All right. Set out. Hog horn for luck. You notice a small dog sitting beneath a, ro a roadside barking at you. What do you do? Uh, try to understand it. The dog leads you to its den. You find a cache of supplies. Hey, dog. Thanks. All right. We're almost there, so we're going to just zoom. Okay. A large sign post appears in the fork ahead, advertising a amusement park off the highway. Let's let's check it out. Sure enough, at the end of the road is a large amusement park, a carnival of rod, wood, rest of metal. Many of the rides and attractions look like they're on the verge of collapsing. Ferris wheel shops the haunted house. Check out the Ferris wheel. Four frames rest it through. It doesn't see the wheels long for this world. Let's do the dumb thing, the fun thing. Get on. Get on the Ferris wheel. You look, to, look out the window and ponder life's great questions, but it seems to have, doesn't seem to have quite the effect at the bottom of the wheel. Ferris wheel is the house. Okay, let's leave that. Uh, let's check out the shops. Coley painted sideboards, now fade with time. Mark this once bustling shopping promenade. Many stalls seem on the verge of collapse. The streets are piled high with garbage. Let's search the street. Don't find anything useful. Search the side streets. Okay, check out the haunted house. Probably a pretty scary haunted house back when it's still running. It's even scarier now that it's dilapidated. Lady's ghost mask is mounted on the door. Remove the mask, enter elite. Remove the mask. Remove the mask and sort it away. If only to get its eyes off you. Fire a ghost mask. Great. Um, enter the haunted house. Inside the haunted house is dark and eerie. The walls are lined with more ghost masks. Their faces twist in gruesome expression. Was this really meant for kids? You light up a torch, but it's even scarier in the light. Search the area. You find an unmoving humanoid figure. At first, you think it's just a very realistic zombie costume, but then you realize it's live affected. It's dormant, however. You should be able to, able to easy avoid it if you're quiet. Uh, escape. This place feels wrong. You run back out the door. Grateful there aren't any mean older kids around to call you a chicken. The heck is the ghost mask? What is the ghost mask? Okay. Attack plus 30%. All right. I'll put that on. Well, that gives me a melee attack. Plus 30%. Okay. Um, Let's check our tires. They look all right for right now. Okay, uh, remove the flags, and let's head for gas station 66. Okay, pickup truck camp. A little more supply of travel gear. They're, they want to try... Okay, so we can either rest. I mean, rest with them. That would give... Rob them. <laughs> trade or chat. You know what? I kind of want to trade and get... Oh, they're selling junk. Um, I'll buy fiber. And while we're at it, let's go look at the craft menu then. Okay, so... I need one more pig iron. Wait, she has a musket. Yeah, we we're trying to make a pipe gun. I need one pig iron for the steel pipe, one pig iron for the pipe gun, and then we can take the musket and the pipe gun and make a standard pistol. So I need two pig irons. All right, uh, check the tires. Uh, man, I really want to see if we can make it over there before I do that. All right, uh, I'm going to take off driving, but I'm probably going to swap to Bandy. All right, set it out. Let's hold the horn for luck. So we stopped and camped, tried hooking up again, and got attacked. Uh, but we can... Okay, so if you get the quick battle, that means you can just do this. Bam. Done. <laughs> do their terrible prowess in bed. Don't interrupt us while we're trying to do things. Uh, we're both kind of sleepy. Let's go ahead and sleep. All right. First thing in the morning. Uh, let's go ahead and eat. Let's see here. Eat a regular fruit. Okay, Mandy, eat the canned fruit. All right, Mandy, take us out. You've arrived at gas station 66. No one knows where gas station 1 through 65 are, but the proprietors insist on keeping the name. Got the task done. Arriving at the gas station, you're stopped by a young woman in need of help. She tells you that her husband went off to explore Necropolis. He's only supposed to be gone a week. It's already been a month. She asks if we can find him. Why on earth would he go to Necropolis? Gown on us, don't worry, going Why would he go to Necropolis? That idiot, he always thought he was invincible. We heard that Necropolis had more infected than anywhere else. He had just had to see it for himself. She buries her hand. I don't even want to think what might have happened to him. Dang it, we're heroes. To Necropolis. Oh, goody. Um, we need you guys, because you're a gas station, to have fuel. Scarce items. Um, oh, we can sell the canned fruit here. Boop. We can sell... Didn't you want pheasants and squabs? You did. Sell the pheasant. Sell the squab. Okay, and then... What's your abundant items? Milk, ore, ointment, and clothing. Uh, we'll buy two clo three clothing just in case we run into the infected traveler. And then all your items. You guys have fuel for sale. I want to buy 
like 700 fuel hey we got a discount on it want to buy like 100 books no we got the money we're just gonna buy all of their books okay and then we're gonna go over here to the repair shop upgrade the truck let's see here i'm thinking okay so we've got fuel we've got water we've got a task we have to do necropolis locate necropolis <sighs> Can we drive straight there? Can we go straight there? All right, just straight through the mountains. Boom, we're done. Depart. All right, me and Mandy are talking. While driving, come across abandoned truck. Let's go ahead and search it thoroughly. Had a good time with the event. If you open it, got some scrap and rations. All right, bet. Um, we're both leveled up. Let's go ahead and get your focus. To tw is focus to 20. Get Mandy up to... We'll go ahead and raise her focus again. Okay, cool, cool. Um... Let's see. Let's go ahead and check tires. I didn't buy any tires at the last town because I'm a ding dong. Uh, <laughs> here's hoping this won't bite us in the butt because we consider we're going into the mega, mega plague zone. All right, I'm going to set out driving through the mountains. You arrived in Acropolis. The once populous capital city has been turned into a living hellscape. Okay. The road into Acropolis is so thick with infected you have to maintain top speed just to avoid getting overrun. From a relatively safe vantage point in the city outskirts, you see the tower and pre fall skyscrapers, not to mention a suffocating mass of unfected stretching all the way to the horizon. Scanning the buildings, you spot up flames. Okay, observe, run away, it's a stress signal. You reach the building, you saw a light coming from, find a whole group of survivors. They tell you that they're explorers who got trapped in the city, among them is the husband of the woman who hired you. They're grateful that you've come out to get them out of there, but how exactly are you going to get out of here? That's the million scrap question. Uh, fight your way out. <laughs> charge through. Charge full speed. Wait for an opening. We will wait for an opening. Patience. Uh, okay, the welling rate more dangerous becomes. All right. Um, you know what? We're going to have to burn fuel. Charge through. Oh, we got beat up. The race out of the city at max speed. Bearing through infected spending so long above your max RPM to deal significant damage to your truck. You drop a survivor at a state point well outside of Acropolis. Uh, the husband from gas station 66 says visit him and his wife in your home for a proper reward. Sounds good. Um, we need pig iron, actually. All right. Uh, furniture recycling. Research blueprint. What? Okay, I can't. My crew intellect's not high enough. Furniture recycling. Strip them for parts. You might be able to get some building materials. Uh, what's the other one? Disassemble debris. Sledgehammer time. Okay, scavenge books. Might be able to find some books in the city's library. Ooh, let's do the two hour. Ooh, we are so close to getting got because we got 54. Uh, trade, what the heck do they have here? Okay, negotiate. Scarce items. Um, well, we already sold off our can. What's your abundant items? Coffee, jewelry, honey, seasoning, relics. Um, up. Oh, we have to run. We have to burn fuel. Oh, oh, we're in trouble. We are in trouble. This might be bad. They are phantasmal. They're explosive. They can spit. They have keen claws. And we just missed. Oh, and there's a 309. Run. Let's get out of here. Okay, decoy. Dang it. We're going to die. We're going to die. I pushed. I flew too close to the sun. Your truck has been... Okay, yep, yep. All right. Okay, so duly noted. Uh, we're going to go back to Necropolis, but this time, don't um, don't get in the fight. Don't hang out for too long. All right. And found an abandoned truck. We'll go ahead and search through because we need pig irons. Dang it. They have steel skin and they're joggers. Uh, run. Burn fuel. Bravely ran away. Let's get the hell out of here. Let's keep going. Raise my focus up. Let's raise Mandy's focus up. Mandy can take over driving. You arrive, arrived at Acropolis again. It's the stress signal. Million scrap question. Uh, charge through. Quickly realize a bad idea. Oh no! Your truck is quickly overwhelmed. One of your crew members, Mandy, dives out to distract the horde. Oh no! Well, I can barely escape. Wait for a crew member outside the city room. Miraculously return, though they've been severely injured. Okay, drop them off. Get the reward. Wait, did healthy and healthy? Oh, oh, okay. Um, we are gonna boogie. We're gonna get out of here while we can. Check the tires real quick. 
Okay, let's head back for the gas station. Uh, Mandy's going to drive, and she's going to take us right back to this gas station. See a small pool of water, see the fist. Let's try our luck. Hey, we got four prawns. Okay, we need to cool the engine off. And we're both tired and both stressed out. Let's uh, camp. Let's sleep. Caravan for Rants arrived in Starlight City. Good to see you. We will sell 50 creds and to buy building materials. While that's going on, uh, you, we're both stressed. So let's try sharing knowledge. Okay, that reduced a little stress. Let's try hook it up again. Terrible prowess in bed. But we reduced a lot of stress. But we're sleepy again. So let's sleep. And now we're going to get attacked. Okay. Get some. All right. Finish out our rest of our night. And let's get the forecast. Eight hours sunny. All right. Let's head out. We aren't that far from gas station 66. Mandy, take us out. All right. Back at the gas station. Explorer. Explorer. When you guys arrive at gas station 66, the explorer's wife greets you warmly and invites you to their home for tea. I can't think you'd ever save my life. That was so exciting. It was so cool. It was like an action movie. What about our reward? Gave me a thousand scrap. Oh, of course, you were here more than earned. Great, so we got a thousand scrap. Okay. So that being the case, let's go to the repair shop. Let's see about upgrading the truck. What can I do with uh let's upgrade the tire durability. Okay, so he just says the same thing. Um did you guys need anything that... No, I've already sold you all this stuff. All right, we can move on is what we could do. Let's see here. Yeah. So map. Reset our map. Okay. We need to get over here. And it looks like to do that, we have to go through this narrow passage here and come around this way. So what is the closest spot? I want to buy more fuel. Sell me fuel. Also, I want to look real quick. See, long way. They need tea, clothing, cheese, hab, squab, pheasants, quails, and rabbits, and tires. Oh! Why do I have zero fuel? Did I sell all my... Buy a thousand fuel. And let's go. Leave the city. Mandy, take us out. Hog horn for luck. Hog Can I, I not have... No horn? Hog horn for luck. Hey, it's the infected traveler guy again. Yeah, we got some more clothes for you, buddy. Got some more electronics for us. All right. Um, let's check our tires, because I didn't buy any tires. Uh, okay, we're going to be alright. We're going to be alright. Let's watch the sunset reduce some stress. Okay, uh, I'll take over driving. Okay, we got 1,500 scrap. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Engine's a little hot. Let's, uh, do like that. We're going to have to watch our, our water. All right. If it starts raining, we'll do that. Okay, I'll take off. Drive it. Uh, hold up. Reset. Can I just go right there? No. Reset. Okay, let's go ahead and check out Blue Tide Manor. It's this true blue rest stop. Uh, let's go to Blue Tide Manor. And they got a bar and a store. All right. Okay. Crash airplane. Someone made a camp out of the wreckage. We don't have a focus. Uh, approach them. Ah, uh, it's it's doggone bandits again. But okay, so sixty-seven. All right. Oh, we are out of ammo. Oh, throw molotovs at them and then get them with our nail bats. Get got. Get some infected meat. All right. Let's check the truck. Uh, repair the hole. Um, we are both tired. Let's camp out. Let us sleep. Great. It's snowing. Great. No idea when the snow the snow's gonna end. Uh, we're gonna set out. All right. We drove out of it. Cool. You've arrived at Blue Tide Manor, private residence. Within this courtyard, the pond where people are sometimes seen fishing. Okay. We can check out the pond. You arrive at the courtyard of the Blue Tide Manor, which features a large fishing pond. Rumor has it's connected to an underground reservoir, resulting in a seemingly inexhaustible supply of fish. Loud in your recliner is a languid young man with a fishing pole and a straw hat. You can't help you. Okay, talk to the man. Hey, you want a coffee? Just what I needed. You guys seem alright. What do you want to talk about? How to fish? Okay, he gave us all of his tips for the particular pond, so you don't know much about fishing a hole, but you have a, think you have a lot more luck fishing here in the future. Mandy, can you raise your fishing? She doesn't have enough trade points either. Can we... We can't actually fish, because our fishing isn't high enough. Alright. 
Um, store. Scarce items. We can sell you our one piece of clothing off the truck. Wow. For 624. Okay. What's their abundant items? Medkit, water, rations, fruit, blah, 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 blah. Prawns, spices, scalps, shrimp. Okay. Let's see what pheasant, quail, wrap, clothing, tea. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything that these guys make. Oh, do you guys have tires? <laughs> they do not. All right. Well, yeah, I know we have, we need water. Um, you guys sell water? Yeah, they do. Let's buy like... Oh, their water is cheap. Yeah, we'll buy like 113 water and not have to worry about it. Okay, let's go to the bar and see if there's anything we can get. Oh, there's a dog. Talk to the dog. Who's a good boy? How could you all have a Because they had to sleep all day and have all my meals prepared before I'm busting it. <laughs> so we're talking, we got the talking dog again. We'll feed him. Yeah, all right. Lowered our stress. Teague. Okay, same amount of fuel. All right. Let's check out the bar. Um. Oh, we can hire a third dude. Uh, hire a worker, rancher, farmer. Let's hire a, uh, let's hire a rancher. Okay, cool. We have compatible. Cool, cool. All right. Now we've hired our, uh, Sig the rancher. So she won't get a whole lot of fatigue back from sleeping. Let's see here. Uh, let's give her sunglasses. Got to find her something for her body. Uh, cook her with the bat for right now. All right, I'm gonna go down through here. See if I can get the pig iron. All right, got our pig iron. Let's see if we can craft this uh, crude rifle. Equip that. All right, Sig, you have a rifle. Does she, does she have a pet? She cannot have a pet yet. We have a Molotov cocktail, though. All right. Where's our bounty task? Okay. And also, I wanted to see if there was any deliveries. 30 wheat to Southern Lookout. Oh, that's nowhere near us. Good, thanks. All right, I think we're going to head out. We'll get a chance to go back by bottom. Oh, tires? Tires? They didn't have tires here, no. Let's leave the city. Uh, Sig, you could drive first. Let's cool the engine off all the way. Now that we have extra water. All right, and let's set out. All right, we got. Oh, let's reset our flags. You arrive at location. Turns out a whole camp of bandits. Time for a fight. Actually, we're gonna let move it. Oh, heck, we might not have to worry about it. There we go. Okay, where are we taking him to? Blue, true blue rest stop. Is that okay down here? All right, reset blue tide manor. Okay, we're not doing that though. We're gonna keep on keeping on. Set us out, Sig. You may arrive at a true blue rest stop. Every house near this rest stop is filled with blue furniture. No one knows why. Okay, got 50 clout, got 900 scrap, turned to the outlaw for justice. All righty, and that's probably gonna wind this one here up considering she's almost exhausted. All right, yeah. Uh, that'll do it for this one, and we will see y'all in the next one where we keep trying to make it up into the northern expanse there to near the city of Metropole. All right, until next time, y'all have a good one. Bye.